When I first heard the diagnosis, I tried to be strong. I tried to be really stoic and keep a brave face in front of the surgeon and my husband who was there with me. But as soon as she left the room, I just burst into tears because then realization set in that the worst, you know, my worst fears had come true. We know Trillium Health Partners will, will always be there for us. Trillium Health Partners saved my life. Cancer affects each and every one of us. It affects our mothers, our fathers, our sisters, our brothers, our friends, our children. In this past year, 3,500 patients were able to get care closer to home at Trillium Health Partners. This is an important set of services that we provide here in our community. That's a service that we need to continue to provide. We need to continue to be able to respond to our community needs, to take those stresses away from them at a time when they're most vulnerable. In a diagnostic assessment unit, we bring all of the specialists to one place so that the patient can see them all at one time. For instance, in the breast diagnostic assessment unit, if a woman has an abnormal mammogram, a surgical specialist will see her in conjunction with a radiologist and review all of the films that she may have had. And if she requires a biopsy, we will do it the same day that she's seen by the surgeon. So we've been able to shorten the time between a warning sign or referral and actual therapy by approximately 80%. I suspected that I discovered cancer uh, in June of last year. I um, felt a lump in my left breast. I had my biopsy at Trillium Health Partners, and I just remember that day. I remember coming in and I was crying, and I'm not a crier, and I was crying, and my husband was there, and I remember going in there, and all the people were so wonderful and nice, and it's amazing what someone holding your hand, what that can do for you. A new women's imaging center at the Credit Valley Hospital will focus on screening for breast cancer and osteoporosis with the goal of decreasing the time between an abnormal mammogram and its diagnosis. It will also ensure that we have the right equipment, that we have the right tools, the state-of-the-art tools that allow our team to continue to provide the state-of-the-art care that our patients deserve. Donor support has been invaluable in the services that we're able to provide for patients in the cancer program. Community support for our hospital is key to our work. With our community, we're able to partner with their time and their financial support in being able to develop new innovative ways to support patients and their families. We're able to test new ideas, work with them on better ways to deliver the care that makes it easier for them at their time when they need us most. We need to build out new ORs to accommodate the growing need and volume within our patient population, provide greater access to care for our, our patient population, reduce wait times, and ensure that we've got a coordinated patient-centered care approach for more privacy and improved patient experience. We're able to work with our community and with those investments to be able to bring the best possible resources to their care, both human resources, equipment, and other technologies that are able to, to really advance our cancer program in a way that we would never be able to do without them. And it's about building something together, and we would not be able to build this without the wonderful community support we enjoy. I'm so thankful that it's here, and not to take it for granted, and not to take the people that work here for granted, or the volunteers, or any of the terrific work that's done. Because of our Trillium Health Partners, I, I'm able to see my children grow up, we're very fortunate and um, we don't want to lose something like this. Hope. I had lots of hope. That's all you can have. But with hope, you also need the resources to make things happen.